George here from the FM Press and today's video is going to be incredibly short, um, it's just a sort of an update video but it's also going to be a how to jailbreak your um, all devices using Black Rain for Mac. Now if you watched my last video which um, was quite long although the jailbreak is incredibly simple um, it's just to notify you about all the warnings that um, before you actually do the Black Rain update or jailbreak sorry. Um, I'm not going to go through the warnings in this video as much in as much detail as I did in the other one, but um, I would recommend watching my Windows one. I'll have it as a um, video response below this one, so just check that out if you really, really want to know um, like all the warnings, which I do recommend you do. But um, yeah, if you're an iPhone user, any iPhone user, um, and uh, you rely on an unlock, please do not do this Black Rain jailbreak because it will uh, not enable you to actually use Ultra Snow, the dev team's unlock program again. So um, yeah, because in order for this jailbreak to work, you need to update to 3.1.2 official from Apple. And when you do that, it updates your baseband, which means that you can't use Ultra Snow. Okay, so um, hopefully you have got that message, but uh, this jailbreak does work for all other devices. Um, the only thing that is attached is uh, the AirPod Touch 3G. It is a tethered jailbreak, which means that when you turn it off, you can't actually reboot it back up again unless you plug it back up to your computer and click the Black Rain icon, um, or sorry, the Black Rain button. Now, um, if I just uh, find Black Rain for you, Oh, sorry, let's just find it inside my Finder applications and hit Black Rain. Um, a link will be in the description so you, where you can download this from. And uh, what you're going to need to do is, as I said, just update your de any device to 3.1.2 um, official, bearing in mind the warnings for iPhone users. Then you're going to need to just hit one button, make it rain, and then you're pretty much done. Um, that's all you need to do. You can then close out of Black Rain. Uh, first of all, it will come up with a confirmation message. Um, your device will go through a series of screens and then it will eventually reboot back up into its normal form. Except you will have a new icon that looks exactly like that, um, a black water droplet. And um, all you're going to need to do is make sure you're connected to a Wi Fi network. Then just click that one icon then tap Cydia at the top of the list and then hit install in the top right once you've done that you can um, remove the black rain icon and then you're done um, there are other options inside black rain um, Cydia and rock I mean sorry IC and rock but I would recommend uh, it's a tip from me that you would just install Cydia on its own okay um, this way is the best way because uh, many people have been experiencing problems if you install more than one. Okay, so I think with that said, then um, hopefully you should have a problem-free jailbreak and everything should go good. Okay, thanks for watching. Please rate, comment, subscribe below. And um, if you didn't catch this, then you can watch the video response below, which um, is hopefully a bit better and um, not so much rushed. Okay. Thanks for watching. Bye.